What's going on, everybody? Dunsparce for the win here, and you welcome back to Adventures in Kanto. We're kicking it back off again in Mount Moon, and we were just about to go face off against this little youngster here, because so many youngsters. <laughs> but anyways, how's it going, guys? We are back with the next episode, and as I said, I am recording this directly after the other one. Because I just want to get a lot of content out really quickly, and that was very stupid of me. But at this point, I should probably just keep going. Okay, yeah, um, he actually has quick attack, and that can actually kill me. So I'm gonna go into Sprout, because Karina is starting to scare me. So, good, tell him. I don't... <laughs> I don't need that kind of... Oh boy, and the Rattata is faster. That, 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 that is very scary. I don't need that kind of... I don't need that kind of hate in my life. I don't need that kind of hatred in my life. Um, let's go on to Borgo, because Borgo actually needs some training too. So, I'm gonna head into him, start training him up a bit. Um, he gets Fury Attack at level 12, I think, and that did a lot of damage. Um, that did a lot of damage, too. So, I'm, uh, going to Sprout again. I think Sprout's gonna get a lot of work for the time being. So, yeah. This is... Sprout is kind of our, like I said before... Our wall, our, our G, our just overall tank, except not really a tank, he's considerably not a tank, but why am I switching into Orgo? This is gonna hurt, except I think Bug resists, except I don't do anything with Poison Sting, so yeah, I'ma switch out of Orgo into... We're gonna go into Randall for this. He's good. Leech life does average damage. Yeah, three three damage, not really anything. That's not even average, it's just kinda of, that's actually pretty low. But either way. Um this youngster's actually pretty pretty annoying, honestly. <laughs> He's got some like, just because our team is not set up for this, like, we have a bunch of attackers, and the problem is so many things actually have, like, bug attacks in this early on, and, like, bug attacks, again, never made any sense why bug was strong against poison, but it is, and that's just... It's just scary, but I think we need a little bit of healing up, so yeah, I think I'm actually not quite yet. I think I'm going to put Borgo up front, and then maybe, yeah, because we got the Geodude Onyx guy up here, which I can send Sprout in against, because they're not going to really do anything to him. But I'm gonna uh, run away from everything because because stuff and things and this actually kind of okay good that actually was gonna scare me for a little bit but we got a moonstone can't actually use it yet but really really the ex the encounter rate the freaking encounter rate. But luckily Paris is slow, but we're gonna go up against you, because you are the mini Brock. Which actually is kind of scary, but also at the same time not, because he doesn't have rock types, or attacks, but he does have rock types, but not rock type attacks. But either way, we're gonna send in Sprout. Tackle's gonna do a decent amount, actually. That's actually surprising. Don't do that again, please. Or you are. Okay. Nice. Right. Okay. 
Lead seed. Not doing a darn thing. Darn. <laughs> Not doing a darn thing. Darn! But Borgo grew to level 11. That's a good thing. We got... This guy is actually... This guy actually might be tougher than Brock. I think he is, but because we've had chance to train up more. Like, this guy was the bane of so many people's existence because, like... We just got done beating Brock! Why do we have to beat these guys? <laughs> but... Ends up being not that bad. And Onyx actually doesn't do as... Doesn't have as high attack, I believe, as Geodude. So, Tackle... Yeah, he doesn't have as much attack, so I'm gonna Leech Seed him. Because I have a feeling that Vine Whip's not gonna one-shot this one. But we're gonna try it anyway, and it actually did. Okay. Oh, well. No big deal. No harm, no foul. But, Sprout is now level 16. And do you know what that means, everybody? What? Sprout is evolving? Dun, dun, dun. Ivysaur. <laughs> That's right, everybody. We got ourselves an Ivysaur out of our Sprout. He is now level 16, 29 attack, 28 defense, 26 speed, and 33 special. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, like I said before, I think I'm going to drop off to heal real quick, and I will be right back. See you all in two shakes of a monkey's tail. All right. Be back in a sec. All right, guys. And why did you move over there? I don't want you. Okay, guys. We are back. So, um, yep. I just went back, healed up a little bit, got everybody fully healed, and we're going to keep on going in. So, I'm hoping that maybe we'll at least get close to finishing this episode. And I gotta get my finger away from the shift button. I really do. But I cannot attack wild Zubats with this guy. Not until he gets Fury Attack, at least, because that'll take forever. But I'm pretty sure Fury Attack is level 12, but this guy I ain't even messing with. I'm just gonna throw Sprout right in the front because this guy is this guy is scary. This guy is crazy scary. I'm just gonna go straight up here. Little kids should leave grown-ups alone. Yeah, this this guy is very scary because this is your first look at Hyper Fang. Yeah. Hyper Fang, everybody. Luckily, he's only using... Yeah, look at that damage just on a tackle. Like, seriously? Jeez. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm actually going to use a potion. Because this is... No, this is not even going to work. I'm going to use a potion right now. Um, yeah, because if he gets a Hyper Fang and a crit, whew, that is a scary, scary thought. Very scary thought. But that, that is a scary sight to see. But I'm hoping that I can get a crit off with this Vine Whip. Oh, I did. Good. Good, good, good. Yes. Okay. We got away relatively harmless. We got away relatively harmless with this guy. That could have been a lot worse. And I mean a lot worse. But yes, you guys probably didn't notice it, but we had a little visitor coming for a second, but I was very caught up in my... <laughs> in that, but yes... 
I think I've told you guys this. My wife and I got a cat now. Her name is Leia, after Princess Leia. Yes, we actually did that. But either way, um, she did come in to visit, but then she walked right out when she saw it. I, I was like, Ooh. but oh my god, I forgot about it. Oh yeah, I mean, I ain't even touching that. No. <laughs> That's just uh, horrifying. But either way, um, we should only have two trainers left, so honestly, I think I'm going to end up just fighting them. This episode might run a little long, but, I mean, it's the finale for Mount Moon, so might as well. But... Either way, Team Rocket will find the fossils, revive, and sell them for cash. Like, I I gotta say though, this game had like really, like it was a terrible story. It honestly was. Like, Team Rocket were just like they were so stupid, and that actually. Good thing he did not crit. Yeah. I'ma go into Sprout again because Sprout is our wall. As I have said many, many times, Sprout is our wall. But either way, I'ma go Vine Whip because that still does a good, decent amount of damage. That's a very scary amount of damage, actually just on a quick attack. But either way, we got Suzubat, and I think I'm gonna send in Karina against him, because Karina has proven to be decent against Zubats. But, yeah, you shouldn't have wing attack yet, so it shouldn't be that terrible. Peck does decent damage against it, and Leech Life does absolutely nothing. Yeah. Absolutely nothing. So he doesn't even listen to me. Oh, gotta love the AI in this game. <laughs> but either way, we're gonna really, like, 1 HP. Really, like, 1 HP. Ugh. But okay, we killed off that Zubat. Karina's level 13. Angel defeated Rocket, because Angel's awesome. Exactly. I really named myself Angel in this. Why didn't I name myself G? I don't know. Because, oh right, because the channel and everything, and I... Th I'm, I'm stupid. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm, I'm tired, I'm stupid. And I didn't really tell you about my... Why am I saving? I force a habit. I'm sorry, everybody. Well, let's actually see what we are doing. Um, Grimers, I believe, we have up against us. So, well, poison types. Grimers and coughings, I believe he has. So... I kinda wanna send in Nick. Yeah, let's send in Nick. Cause I need to get you to a Nidorino. Hey stop! I found these fossils! They're both mine! But... We're gonna go. Super Nerd wants to fight. Super Nerd sent out a Grimer. I remember him. I always remember these things. But Horn Attack, gonna do decent damage, actually. Don't you... Oh, okay. <laughs> I'll take that. Thank you. Thank you. I'll, uh, I appreciate that. Pound. That actually does a decent amount of damage, actually. But, yeah. I need to get Nick to a Nidorino, so that he can actually, like, you know, learn some decent attacks and actually do some damage, which Nick does decent damage as it is already, but... Poison Sting! Yay! 
Doesn't learn double kick until he evolves, I believe. Oh, right, I forgot he has a Voltorb, too. Oh, well. No harm, no foul. Um, but let's go Horn Attack and alternate it off, because Horn Attack actually does decent damage, but Poison Sting also doesn't do that bad of damage, actually. Because stab versus non-stab, but either way. Horn Attack, gonna do some damage. Yes, I am not keeping my Pokemon at average levels and everything like that. It's just, it's gonna be too much of a hassle to... Because certain Pokemon are just better than others for, like... I try training them up. I'm gonna try training them up, but the, in this playthrough, certain Pokemon are just gonna be weaker than others. And I'm going to try, but it's gonna be... Like, Beedrill, right now, all it has is Poison Sting. And can't really hurt much. So, Nick grew to level 15. That was easy enough. But okay, Angel Nerd defeated Super Nerd. Angel Nerd, yes, Angel Nerd defeated Super Nerd. But either way, you want the Helix Fossil? Do we want to go with Meme Lord? Or not Meme Lord? Because Helix Fossil is Ammonite, and Dome Fossil is Kabuto. Now, I love Kabutops. Amastar is kind of okay. I love, I love Kabutops, though. He's my favorite of the two. But, I don't know. Do we want to go with memes? Or do we want to go with my favorite? Eh. The meme's been dead for a while, so... Angel got the dome fossil. Yeah, 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 take your memes. <laughs> but I, I actually watched that stream a couple of times, and it was it was actually pretty entertaining, surprisingly. It, it was actually really entertaining to watch all of it. Just people floundering around. It was kind of funny. But either way... We are going to go through here, and we are outside Mount Moon. Okay, guys. Um, yeah, I think that's where I'm going to call it. So um, next episode, we're going to head into Cerulean City a little bit. And yeah, this is the last episode I'm going to be recording for this set amount of episodes and everything. So either way, um, thank you all for watching, and... I will see you all next time then. Alright. Peace.